In all my previous videos, I've been discussing about what to do when a child is throwing a tantrum or is having a meltdown. Today, I want to speak about the other side of the coin, the field of positive psychology. Because children are also full of hope, optimism, positive emotions, love and joy. And these are very important emotions to have. From an evolutionary perspective, all positive psychologists speak about what is the importance of positive emotions. When we are in a state of positivity and joy and happiness, we are more creative, we are broad minded, we are building resources at this time. So it's very important to develop these traits in our children. Positive psychology speaks about a strength based approach where rather than concentrating on what is not going right or what is the weakness of the child, we look at the strengths of the child and what is going right. What happens is as parents we make a mistake that we put our entire concentration on what is not going well and where the marks are not coming and what subjects the child is failing in while we forget that each child is a unique combination of talent and for sure the child must be doing very well on some other aspects of life whether it's art, drama, music, any creative pursuits or some subjects that are to the liking of that child. So to concentrate and shift our focus from the weakness to a strength based approach. According to positive psychology, inculcating positive emotion leads to an upward spiral increasing positivity while concentrating on weaknesses and negative emotion causes a downward spiral leading to a depressed mood. So we as parents should shift our focus from the weaknesses to applauding them, to appreciating their accomplishments and their strengths. This is what helps in building resilience in the long term and helps the children face any failures in their life or adverse situations that may come up.